So far, 2018 has been an exciting one for investors, although experts who spoke to the age last year warned that the 10-year boom and bust cycle could be ending. What will the rest of 2018 bring? Will the bull market continue to rage or will it age? And how can investors position their portfolios to navigate the, the, the times ahead? I spoke to some of you, um, two key themes came up. The first one was FX, and the other one is on the elections. Now, recently, the Chinese have expressed some concerns uh, about the pace at which their currency has been strengthened. And if they start to take more stringent measures to try and stem that, possibly because of the rise in trade tensions with the U.S., and if the ring, it, it's, if the, if the CNY starts to uh, stabilize or weaken, that will have certainly have an impact on Southeast Asian currency, including the Malaysian ringgit, and that might stem some of that or dampen some of the sentiment in the ringgit. I think we are very uh, uh, up, uh, upbeat about the banking sector. We think that there is a lot, there is more upside in it to it, and the ROEs of the banks are finally recovering. While we hope to see uh, continual evolution of cryptocurrencies today, they're very difficult to invest in. We don't think of them as an asset class, uh, and it's really hard to set uh, what the value of a cryptocurrency is. So in many ways, it feels like it's just pure speculation. I look at cryptocurrencies as an application on a much more important and fundamental technology, and that is around blockchain. Blockchain is really a distributed, authoritative, uh, distributed database uh, that we see applications in not only in cryptocurrency, but in security, in uh, various back office financial services applications. And so we're really spending our time uh, trying to understand the core of that technology and the various applications that it can uh, find. It's a very holistic as well as the uh, domestic uh, uh, perspective of things and information. It actually gives me a better insight of what's available. 